Bet you're not going to feel as bad for Krista Freeland once I tell you why she was actually here. She was here signing documents to further expand a Federal Reserve up to four times what it originally was. What does that mean? Well, under the guise of protecting 150 caribou, she's legally able to take away farmland. So if you farm there, you ranch there, you live there, you have until the end of December to comply with federal demands to either move out or put it as protected land where you won't be able to farm on it anymore. Furthermore, if you have an oil rig on this land, you're going to have to pull it off because now it's protected. I was sitting around trying to figure out how they were going to go about taking away farmland because I didn't think for a hot second farmers would be down with this and okay with this, but they found a legal loophole, which means that, yeah, you can take it to court, yeah, you can try to fight it, but it's not going to mean squat. You will lose. Definitely you will lose because now it's federal provincial land. How can they do this? Well, technically, anybody that owns land in Canada, unless you signed over sovereignty and gotten the original land patent, you don't actually own it. You're leasing it from the crown. The government can do whatever they want with their crown land. You're essentially just renting it from the government and the crown. It's never yours, even though your name's on the title and you pay the taxes for it. It's never actually your land. It's scary to think what they can do. It's scary to see what they have done. And it's going to get worse. If you think your groceries are expensive now, if you think that you're having a hard time finding things in the grocery store now, you just wait. They're going to make us solely reliant on the imports of other countries. And before you go, I don't believe you, Thor says, proof? Go and look it up. It's disgusting what they're able to do under the guise of environmental control. Oh, did you also know that in Winnipeg, they built a new ECC center? What is that? <clears throat> basically an armory with interrogation rooms for environmental enforcement. Wait, why would they need environmental enforcement?